Hey guys, I'm Alex Brown and welcome to the video. This week is going to be a little bit different. It's still a vlog, gig log kind of thing. Uh, but this week is going to be different. First of all, because I have to work around my school schedule uh, for this event because it's actually happening during the week. And the reason it's happening during the week is it is an event production. It's AV stuff. So TV screens, microphones, speakers, that kind of stuff. If you don't already know, I do have a separate brand that I do event productions under uh, called the EPR team. Still toying around with that, but I'm not gonna ramble on too much more about that. You're gonna see what I can show you out of the event. And you might notice that I'm sitting in a parking garage right now, and that's because I just got out of my night class at school. And this is the only time that I've had so far today to actually start the vlogging. I actually started setting up today. This is just a little shot I took for the Instagram story going around the room. Uh, of course, follow at DJAB Entertainment on Instagram or at EPRTMRI. Yeah, I was just crazy busy today. I set up, ran to school, went home to eat, and then came back to school. So it's been very busy, and unfortunately, I couldn't really get a lot of the setup. I have some pictures that I'll add as well, um, but that was really it. Now, tomorrow, I will be there from 7.45 in the morning to 5 p.m. Good morning, everyone. Uh, today is the official day one of two days. And I woke up maybe 10 minutes ago. Luckily, they provide meals, which is nice. Uh, but I am still a little bit tired. Long day yesterday. So it's time to head there now and show you what the venue looks like a little bit and some other things when we get there. out to grab a piece of gum talked about that in the last video um, we're a little bit we're close to the end of the day we're geez I'm getting rained on I'm done <laughs> Okay, so we just uh, finished up day one, two. I'll be seeing you back tomorrow. I just showed you some clips of kind of what they did today. I tried to get a little bit of video. Uh, maybe I'll do a time lapse of the breakdown, but we have a special breakdown window because of the venue. So um, yeah, we'll see you back tomorrow morning. Okay, so I don't know if I mentioned it yesterday, but I've been a little, little bit sick again. I don't know what's going on, but it's not detrimental to my work, so that's good. Um, uh, so yeah, so it's the start of day two or three, depending on how you want to look at it. It's day two of the event itself, but it's actually day three for me because day one would have been the setup day. I will be opening for Julie again on Saturday night, uh, but for now, I'm going to head there and get everything turned on. It's uh, lunchtime right now, and it's not much to say. I don't really necessarily have a lot to do. Um, it's a lot of downtime. Sorry, someone was moving catering stuff. Um, but yeah, there's a lot of downtime, and it's just kind of the nature of, event, of the event because it's kind of like a conference type of thing, and they're trying to redesign high schools. So there's a lot of specific work that's conversational that doesn't really involve AV type of stuff minus the fact that there's a screen on and then these facilitators kind of go out and speak on the mic and direct them on what to do and this time 
there's a lot more work. Last time wasn't as much like this, but this time it's less on me, more like people working in their groups. So guys, I just got back home. Luckily, they ended um, a little bit past four o'clock. And right now I'm just opening up the box truck because I actually have to unload it pretty much right now and get my car loaded for tomorrow's football game, which I'll be doing sound for. Not sure if I've ever included those in a vlog, but I'm probably not going to this time. Nonetheless, uh, everything went well. Um, breakdown was very fast. We got everything out and loaded in an hour maybe a little over an hour which it was a good amount of equipment which three guys was what made it quick and uh you know we were out of there within the venue's time frame i think we were leaving by 5 15 and we needed to have everything out and packed uh by six o'clock uh when they have their next event going in so uh, we got that all set i've decided to include the um uh, tomorrow? I can't keep track of what day it is. Uh, tomorrow night, so uh, stay tuned for that. So quick side note, guys. Um, this case is super old that I got it used on Craigslist. I actually repainted the whole thing because it had, had stickers over it and some paint on it, so I cleaned it up. But um, yeah, as I was bringing it out, these super, super old casters, two of them just completely failed. So these are just totally gone. Uh, I need to take this off to see if I can still use this wheel piece here. Same thing here. Um, this one, you can see it's already cracking and, and just coming apart. It's just cause it's old. So I need to replace the casters on this case. This one looks okay, but I'll replace this one too. Um, because it's only a matter of time before this one just gets too old and splits and cracks up um, Just like these guys did Oh, by the way, it's Saturday. Uh, I'm at the football game. I Just took a walk over to the school uh, And to go to the bathroom um, The school is far away by the way. It's It's not like a mile, but like it's a it's a significant walk. It takes a few minutes to walk over there and I'm using the Yorkvilles today. Typically I use the Yamahas. I wanted to use the Yorkvilles because I've never used them here. And wow, they throw so far. Like I can make out every detail of the song while I'm standing at the door to the school, which is at least a minute or two walk away. So I just wanted to add that little anecdote. We'll be back to see uh, before I open for Julie later. Okay guys, I'm sorry, I'm uh, not using my tripod. Hopefully th this doesn't mess my camera up. I have to hold it with my right hand, which I don't like doing because I forgot to take my laptop stand out of the car, so I had to bring it and I just parked. So I have to walk a little while with this in hand. Um, I'm sorry, this is probably super shaker, shaky, but yeah, uh, about to head into the club now. I really need to park closer to the club because walking all this equipment is, that doesn't sound good. But yeah, I'm gonna drive to park a little bit closer. Typically I just park in front of the club, hazards on uh, when I drop the equipment off, but bringing it out, 
not so easy. They have some roads closed, but uh, that's gonna wrap it up for this video. So thank you for watching guys. Please subscribe to the channel. Please drop a comment if you wanna say anything. As always, please leave a thumbs up on the video. That's gonna be it for this one. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.